my message to black girls. And mind you, I said black girls because black girl, I am also a black girl and I also identify with this. So black girl, if you are a black girl listening to me right now, understand something that you are beautiful. I want you to say that to yourself, that you are beautiful. I see you. I see what you're going through. I see your pain. Don't you dare let people tell you who you are, what you are, what you can accomplish, what you can do, and where can you go. Because that is not nice at all. You, you cannot let people determine I, your life. You cannot let people tell you what to do. I want you to understand that before anybody, before anything, there is you that you have to put yourself first you gotta love yourself first you cannot allow anybody to disrespect you i don't care who they are i don't care where they're from i don't care what their position in society you cannot you cannot allow that you always have to stand up for yourself don't you dare sit down and cry because somebody told you you're ugly because somebody is talking about your hair your hair is beautiful regardless what, regardless you use wigs, regardless you perm your hair, regardless whatever. You are beautiful. Everything about you is beautiful. Your eyes is beautiful. Your nose is beautiful. Your lips are beautiful. Everything about you is beautiful. Don't you dare allow anybody to tell you that you are ugly. You cannot tolerate that. We cannot tolerate that. You have to love yourself. If you're being bullied in school, don't just sit down and cry. Don't allow it from anybody. I don't care who this person is. I don't care who, how they look like. I don't care whatever. Stand up for yourself. And meaning stand up for yourself is when they bully you, get back on them. Don't feel weakened or don't listen to their horrible words. Do not listen to it. You have to love yourself first. That's how you, you have to stand up for the bully. Meaning, when they say something to you, say back to them. Don't just let that word get in your head, in your ears, telling you, you ugly, you ugly, you ugly. That's not true. You're not ugly. Trust me, you're not ugly. You are very beautiful. You are very wanted. You are made by God. And that's why you should love yourself. You should never. Th there should be no words coming out of your mouth. I'm sorry. Your mouth or your head telling you that you are ugly. Or thinking or even imagine that you are ugly. You are not ugly at all. You are beautiful. Huh? You are very beautiful. If somebody tell you you're ugly. Tell them they're ugly themselves from thinking that you are ugly. They're just jealous of your beauty. Beauty. Yeah. Why are they so threatened about your beauty? Hmm? Because they are jealous of you. Don't allow this from anybody. You cannot allow it. I don't care if it's coming from men or women. You cannot allow this from anybody. If you're being bullied in school, answer them back. Don't just sit down and cry because it could lead to other things. If you need to talk to somebody, talk to somebody. If they tell you anything to hurt you, tell them something to hurt them back. Hmm? I'm being very serious. And I know that you're watching this because you're going through the same thing. Hmm? Sit there and think about it. Is this really true huh? are you just gonna let people bully you like that or are you just gonna sit down and think bad things about yourself if somebody don't like you you they don't ha nobody have to like you who said somebody have to sit there and like you or or approve you huh they're not your parents even if they are huh you don't live nobody's life you gotta live your own life be happy with yourself and don't think that you have to hate yourself so you can be accepted. No. I see a lot of people, they trying to be accepted. Do not do that. Accept yourself first. 
And if others don't accept you, that's their problem. Hmm? You are beautiful with wigs, with your natural hair, with nappy hair, whatever, with 4C hair, 43 hair, for whatever hair. It's yours. It was made by God. You are unique. You are beautiful. You are strong. You are worthy. Remember the great things about you. That your looks does not, just your looks does not define who you are. Remember how strong you are, how talented you are. Remember everything about you. That you cannot allow people to continue disgrade you. Don't focus on that online bullying. Don't focus on that. Even if they're doing that, ignore it. Or if you have to fight back, fight back. But don't let those things get in your head, destroying you. You are beautiful. I'm going to say it one more time. You are beautiful. You are very wanted. There's people out there that really like you, that want you. Get out of the toxic, the toxic people. Hmm? Get away from them. Even if you have to go away, stay away from people like that. Make new friends. And once you make new friends, remember what, what those other people did to you. So if it's because you got too comfortable with those people in the past that bullied you, remember, I always have to step up for myself. Hmm? I cannot let myself go um, like this. Don't ever feel insecure. Don't, don't you dare feel insecure about yourself. You are beautiful. I am I'm telling you that. You are so beautiful. And you are worthy of everything. You deserve the best. You don't deserve people shitting on you. And why are they bullying you? Huh? It's because they are miserable themselves. They see the potential in you. They see that you are happy. They see that you are beautiful. That you have high self-esteem. And they want to tear that down. And because misery loves company. They want you to be like them. Do not allow this. Do not. Hmm? Once they say something bad to you. Answer back. Even if you have to say something bad too. Hmm? You are very beautiful and very wanted. You cannot allow this. You cannot allow people making fun of your lips. You have beautiful lips. God made your lips like that. Why? Why is even people making fun of God's creation? I really don't understand it. So, there's people out there walking around who are sick in the head. They have mental problems. They are miserable and they want to make you miserable. Do not let yourself fall into it. You cannot let this happen. I'm telling you that. You cannot let these people, these miserable people, make your life miserable. Do not allow it. If, it's, you, if you are in a relationship where people are making, are trying to make you miserable, get out of that relationship. If those are your friends giving you mean, uh, mean compliments, get rid of them. They have to go. Huh? So I think this is all I have to say. I just have to, you know, say just a little thing. And I just want you out there to be happy, to be safe. Don't think about doing anything bad just because people out there hate you or they don't like you. And remember, somebody that hates you, they always have you in their head. Thinking about you. Thinking what they're going to say next. You are beautiful. You are worthy.